These moms said they had a hard time finding bilingual books for kids, so they decided to make their own. There was no books at that time that I really felt represented our Latino culture, our elements, our, our stories and celebrations. So Patty Rodriguez and her friend Ariana Stein started Little Libros, a bilingual Spanish and English children's book publisher. The first book was Frida, which shows kids how to count in Spanish and English. They started three years ago with the hopes of selling a few books. Now, we have sold over 180,000 books. Uh, we are at over uh, 100 independent bookstores. We are at Target. Uh, we are at Barnes & Noble. The books are also at more than 14 museums nationwide. Parents from as far as Australia have ordered the books, and the two founders use them with their own kids too. Ariana reads the books to her four-year-old son. If he sees something that he recognizes, like a bird, he'll say, oh, el pájaro, you know? So that's, and it's, it's it feels really good because you know that you're doing something right. They hope more parents, not just Spanish-speaking ones, find the value in exposing their kids to two languages. The benefits of being bilingual, in, whether it's in any language, you know, outweigh any any of the myths, you know, surrounding bilingualism. The two business partners and childhood friends have more titles in the works and even board games too, and they have their sights set wide. So the next step is to move to the older age group so that we can continue to grow with that child so that they don't they don't lose us and we don't lose them. Patty still works full time as a producer for On Air with Ryan Seacrest, but Ariana recently left her corporate job to dedicate herself full time to Low Libros. We didn't have any publishing experience. We didn't know what an ISBN was. We didn't know what we were doing, but we knew what we wanted to accomplish and we knew that we wanted to execute something this special. 